Hello inventors, this is Saurabh and in this video we will learn how we can create simple static website using HTML. So that's the second part. So in the first part we have completed this code, simple code and what's the result of this code? Let me show you. So open my folder and open my website and you can see till now we have completed this basic thing. Now let me just change this background. So open the pixel way and i'm going to download this one image click on download and make sure download this 9020 to 1280 and download it now go to the folder option here now go to the download folder and move this image here okay in your website folder that's our folder so i'm going to rename this to bg1 or you can say just bg.jpg now let me just change in my code simple pg dot jpg and save it now refresh my website this one and you can see right now let's do one thing i'm going to convert this whole website to promote my youtube channel or promote something like that so i'm going to create this website for my channel okay so for that what i will do i'm going to uh, rename this heading okay change this heading and i will show here some of my youtube videos i'm going to create one scroller something okay and here i will use one button to display watch my video or subscribe my channel something like that okay so let's start so let me just change this heading first thing hello world to you can see the coding bus okay and let's just uh, we have to put some videos here. So how we can do this? So open YouTube Okay, and I'm to open my YouTube channel and open any video and we have to embed it that video Okay, so how we can do this? So open any video here click on this share button and you will find your Embed option click on it and then you have to click on this copy option, right? Copy it now go to the code Okay uh, VS code and just paste it here simple nothing and save it okay now open my website that's my website here so open my website here this one and refresh this and you can see the coding bus and that's my video now I should this should be in a center right this should be center so let's uh, define some CSS okay so I'm going to use your inline CSS so you can see the white now let's define something or like text align text align to center save it and refresh this right the coding bus in the center and that's my video now i want here this video is larger so i'm going to make it smaller height should be and width should be small so what you can do here you can just change this value like width is 562 you make it 500 or you can make it to 85 or something and save for save it uh, command s or control s and refresh it right now if i want more videos here so what i will do i'm going to copy paste you can just you know uh, just go to your youtube channel and get the all iframe links uh, okay embedded links now refresh this suppose i have like three videos here right now what the problem is like you can see the space here so let's make it in a center first okay so how we can do this so for that we have to use one thing here we have to use a lot of thing like first thing is i'm going to use your div actually if i want to use your style of css like this one so i have to put this all these line in here 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 so what i will do i'm going to use your css in the header and let's create the first uh, one class or uh, just dot okay and i'm going to make it center and curly bracket start and close write this that is class now but make sure one thing is important before starting the class you have to define we are going to write the css so for that we have to define a style that okay and close this tag here right style and style close and now let's write css center and now let's define here text align text line to center okay justify text okay 
so justify content to make it center and one more thing uh, display uh, display flags actually display this display flags this one symbol now save it okay now let's uh, refresh this okay but wait now we have to call this css first important thing so what i am doing i'm going to remove uh, two uh, videos from here and i'm going to wrap these two line in one div okay so div is just a component okay so suppose that is the box div is suppose a box okay and you are writing the css you are applying the css on coding for this div okay so how we can apply for this so just type here class okay now we have to call all these design all these tags in this div so for that you can say define dot center that is class name so just define your center simple save it and let's see how it's work here you can see that one is in a center right right now so that is the uh, class for dev right that one so i'm going to def i'm going to change these uh, component like that one is first iframe that one is second so that is iframe so i'm going to code i'm going to css for iframe so for that just enter and just uh, just simply iframe and curly bracket start and close and make sure if you are using that component like iframe dev body okay so you don't need to define dot here but if you are using center or something other text so you have to use dot okay so iframe so i'm going to define your border border and that should be solid and you can say uh, 10px okay and color i'm to make it uh, suppose white just type here white okay now let's refresh this here you can see that is the uh, border okay uh, around this videos and that is the px like we have defined uh, the border thickness is uh, around what is like this one 10px okay and the border color is white that's why this look, look like this okay now you can define the padding option also so i'm going to define the padding padding and i'm to define padding 10px simple and let's refresh this right here you can see that's the padding that we have defined right so it's look like now amazing it's cool right now okay now what we can do here we can implement more videos here simply just copy and paste and let's just scroll both videos or you can say let me just scroll something else okay so what i end you here i'm going to scroll one text here to update about my website update about my youtube channel so let's uh, do this so i'm going to create one more div okay div open and close and just simply here type h1 okay why we are using h1 it's just for hiding so what i'm going to do h2 i'm going to use for update and just type here uh, the coding bus uh, yt channel update right and you can see that text look like this no i have to scroll this text okay so uh, okay what uh, one more thing what we can do here i'm to define the css for h2 like you know that like h2 component h1 component iframe component they are all uh, already defined in the uh, in the html so we don't need to uh, create a class for that okay if i just use again the iframe they are already defined so you don't need to uh, tell that where we have to use it whenever we use iframe this css both css will apply on every iframe if i just suppose define simply h2 only h2 and curly bracket open and close and define the text color so i just put your color and i'm to make it white okay and just refresh this here you can see the white color right now if i suppose change this to h2 to h1 okay i'm to h1 save this and let's try again here you can see the black because we have to apply here css okay and we are using the css for h2 and let me just change h2 to h1 and now i am using, using here h1 should be white and you can see the h1 so this css will apply here so save it and refresh this 
like this now we have defined in the uh, first like again the style css we don't need to do this okay yeah but we have to align text line should be center so i'm going to remove this css from here okay save it and let's see the color should be white but we have to make it in a center so we will define this text like this here text align center and let's refresh this right both are center because both are h1 heading right so the coding bus youtube channel update now let me just change the background color of this okay so uh, i'm to make it okay now what i'm doing here i'm to define this one as a as two because i have to change the design of my uh, updates and i have to change uh, this design so i'm to upload h2 color should be white okay and the uh, text line i'm to make it in a center and i'm to make it a background so background color i'm to make it tell okay and save it and now let's refresh this here you can see the coding buzz by the channel update now i'm going to scroll this this should be a scroll that text should be okay so for that we will use marquee tag so in this before h2 i will use your marquee tag so m a r q u w e right marquee tag and close this marquee tag close m a r q u w e save it and let's sort of oh make sure we are using our marquee tag we have to close our marquee tag after h2 right now let's refresh this here you can see that one is scrolling and the thing is actually our text is in a center that's why we are not able to see this text in the front and you can see the coding buzz yt channel right now what i can do i'm i'm not going to scroll this uh, this whole uh, h2 also so what i can do here i can use this css this css okay in the only text not my heading so let's try this how this work okay so i'm going to remove this sorry so delete this marquee tag from here so so just simply uh, enter then enter then enter enter and close this marquee tag right and you can see what we have done here simply we have defined the marquee tag in the text only not h2 so what will happen let's see here you can see the background layer is not moving why because we have defined the marquee tag in only text that's why this is moving now i am going to move one image also i want to move one image also so how can i do that so simply for that we just need one image tag okay that we have defined something wrong here in a div is div is open div is close uh, we have done some wrong actually we have okay make sure you have to close h2 tag oh right let's use one button here okay i'm going to use your button okay so let's uh, so i'm not going to use a proper button i'm going to use your link okay and we will convert that link in to button using css so let's uh, create one more div simple div start div close div start div close okay and div start close now let's code for something like i have to use button so for uh, whenever you use the some links so you have to use a tag a and that the property of a tag is you have to just open a tag and close a tag and put some tags like uh, watch my videos okay simple and let me just refresh this you can see watch my videos is very small here right now so what i do here i'm going to css for a tag so let's do for css for a tag so how we can do that simply type a then open curly bracket and close okay font size i'm going to make it uh, large or you can define like a of 30 pixel or 40 pixel and text align center okay and the uh, text color so just define your color to something white save it and refresh this you can see watch my videos now whenever i click on it nothing will happen right so i have to put here link so for a tag link we have to define one property of this a tag and that the property is h r e f okay and equal then double quotation and you have to put the link so i'm going to open my channel 
that one the coding bus and I'm going to put my channel link here okay now let's refresh my website and let's see how it's for watch my videos now click on it here you can see now I'm redirecting to my YouTube channel right now go back that one now this one is not aligned uh, you can see that we have uh, use your text line to center but this one is not working here right so what I can do here I'm going to use your CSS for like on a center CSS here you can see we have defined your center so I'm going to call this CSS in this div okay let's try this so just class equal and our class name is center save it and refresh this watch my videos but you can see this is not look good so I'm going to define the background color I'm, I have to make it as a button this should be look like a button right so how we can do this so first thing we have to define the background color of that button so we have to define background color in a a tag so background so background color should be I'm to make it tell suppose or red I think red okay red and refresh this you can see but this is not look good now so what I can do here I'm to make a padding here okay so let's try this padding so I'm to padding is 10 px suppose okay and refresh how it's look right cool it's look good now now I'm going to define the border of this button so simple so oh make sure this is not a button right we are we are converting this link into look like a button okay we can use button also but we have to done more coding okay so that's why I'm using a CSS now let's do something border border so border should be solid make sure this should be a 5 pixel border and the color I'm to make it yellow yellow green is fine yeah save it and let's refresh this right that's the border watch my videos so that's our overall website I think it's fine so tomorrow we will learn how we can publish this website because I think almost we have completed something because there are a lot of things in HTML okay I will make a separate whole and two and three hour video for HTML but right now it's enough for uh, like uh, enough for you I think because we have learned a basic of HTML now let's learn how we can publish this website to Firebase so anyone can access this website so tomorrow we will learn about this because this video is going too long that's fine so thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe my channel like this video and share this video and if you have some doubt just comment on the video okay bye bye